Welcome to Tech Brothers with Damir. In this video, we are going to answer this question. Which language RDL files are made of in SSRS? So RDL stands for Report Definition Language. And let's take a look. If we create the reports, these all files are saved with the extension RDL. So this is the one of the reports I have created. Here is a parameter called P region. And if I will provide the value to this one, you will see these fields uh, I have salesperson first name salesperson last name country and region uh, and uh, these are the records uh, return uh, let's go ahead and take a look on the data source uh, we have a DS uh, source file and then uh, in the data set uh, we have all those uh, fields available uh, and the parameter here we have a P region uh, in this report I'm not using any image uh, so what I'm, why I'm showing you all that because I'm going to walk you through the RDL file and show you what exactly happen uh, with these uh, different fields or, or items. Uh, so let's go ahead and right click on the CSV data source report uh, and take a look. Uh, view code and you will see that uh, this is XML file. So to answer our question, the RDL files are XML files. Uh, and uh, the very first part uh, you see here, this is kind of style. So you see that uh, we have a uh, tablex uh, and we have different columns here and uh, we have it tells up uh, how much uh, the height for that column and all that and width uh, and then uh, we can see that it can grow or can't grow sale person uh, uh, first name and bold so this is all styling what we see in our uh, report right here so we see that sale person first name and then if I go back to the let me go back uh, to the XML and uh, you see that the sale person first name and we have bold then uh, we have light gray solid orange that's the background color so you see that this is more styling if i go further down here i'm gonna see all other information as well so let me go right here this is a pretty big uh, uh, file so right here i have data sets so in the data set i will see all those fields and here i i have the data source so you, you can see that what data source name is uh, what is the provider and uh, different uh, connection string and all that and uh, what is security we are using so all that information is uh, saved here let's go further down here and we see the parameters so we have only one parameter p region and we can see that uh, right here so in in short uh, this uh, xml file contain pretty much everything what we have in our report uh, it, it will be containing our images uh, uh, our tablex matrix whatever we use uh, all the styles uh, and the fields of uh, in the data sets uh, uh, and further uh, we have parameter or data sources all that information will be saved in this xml so rdl's uh, files uh, are saved uh, in xml format so thanks very much for watching this video and good luck with your interview and i will see you guys in the next uh, video